is quickly becoming an industry that could rival slots and tables on the strip. Today, the Luxar opened its new massive esports arena. 13 Action News reporter Tom George is live with a look at their arena, and he has the story of a local woman turning her passion for gaming into a career. Tom. Yeah, and just like any other sport, you can see the setup right here. They're actually getting ready for a match right now, but you can see arena-style seats and a full-blown screen with all, the, all of them getting ready for the game. And this is really bringing in a lot of video game enthusiasts, and it's also draw, drawing in even more women to the sport. With her headset on and ready to go. Oh, and this has to warm up, takes a second. Danielle Rajvalski is ready for work. Her office right on her couch. Her job playing Call of Duty. Everybody could use a gun or a grenade for shanking people. Now that's fun. But how is this a job, you might ask? People across the hemisphere. I have people in Antarctica. Like, I'm like, how do you get Wi Fi out there? People from around the world are watching her play and paying her to do it. They follow you and then they tip you as they see fit or Generously, it just depends on the day. She's built a following broadcasting on the platform Twitch under her alias Electronella. I'm talking like this and then I'm all talking like this. And eventually growing that following will mean a big payoff. Probably more than a teacher salary here in Nevada. But for Richvalski, this didn't start as a job. Four years, I couldn't even raise my pinky by itself. She got so good at gaming after she was run over by a truck four years ago. This became her therapy. Now I can move my thumb. It's amazing. Now with esports becoming a billion dollar industry, she sees more and more women getting in on the action. I didn't even know that there was so many female Call of Duty players, but yeah. And while having complete strangers watch you online might seem odd. I've been harassed and guess what? You got a ban button. Ban. <laughs> Rich Volsky is just beginning. Now we're coming in, so move on over. Because Electronella's coming. <laughs> Back live here, you can see it's pretty intense here. There's a huge crowd here as this match is set to start. You can see both teams on both sides. Richvalski says she wants to get some fel uh, fellow female gamers to do games right here at the Luxor at some point as well sometime in the future. Reporting live, Tom George, 13 Action News. Wow. You were right, though. You said that looked like NASA. Yeah, it it's does. It's kind of like a cross between the Westgate Sportsbook <laughs> and Launch Control. Exactly.